These are the last-minute preparations for Niger's historic elections on Sunday, ahead of what is set to be the country's first ever peaceful handover between elected presidents. After the current leader, Mahamadou Isofu, voluntarily stepped down after serving two five-year terms. Mohamed Bazoum, a former interior and foreign minister, is the front runner. He's facing off against two former heads of state, Mahaman Usman and Salou Djibo but not against his main rival, former Prime Minister Hama Amadou, who was barred from running due to criminal charges, which he says are trumped up. The elections come amid a background of growing jihadist violence in the country. Niger observed three days of mourning earlier this month, after terrorists killed 34 people in a village in the northeast in the run-up to local elections. <laughs> The army will be out in force on Sunday to protect voters in a nation that is chronically unstable and is ranked as the most disadvantaged country in the world by the UN's Human Development Index.